Oh, looky here. I've got a good second hand diff assembly for my Mercedes. Brakes and all, even though they haven't been turned in 20 years. Looks pretty good. The coupling looks nice. Hmm. Yeah, horrid. Horrid. My brakes are good, so I'll we'll swap them over. Nice. Well, I'll clean this all up and the gasket showed up, so I'm just going to put it all together now. Since I'm going through all this trouble, I thought I'd get a genuine Toyota gasket for that front cover and the other gaskets. The last thing I want is because there's for the oil feed from the oil pump. So these are under quite a lot of pressure. The last thing I'd want is gaskets blow out and make a horrible mess. And yes, that would just upset me. So this is a proper genuine gasket. Kill. Oh, isn't that nice? So pretty. Well, before I put this sump back on, I just thought I'd show you the inside of the diesel. This engine has got oil injection system for the cylinders. You can see the little oil feeder up there. There's the piston. There's Conrad. See it on that one too. Bit hard to move around in here. So yeah. Cool. Not much to see. Just pistons and rods. And a crank. Well, I got it all back together. Kinda of forgot to video a lot of it. So I've already started it when I put the timing belt in. But now I've put everything back together, so now let's start it and run it properly. So, I'm just going to find the keys. Oh, well, now i found the keys. Give it a go there. rattles on the tail, I'll have to fix that. It's running. Oh, I chucked the driver's seat in, so I figured I'll take it for a drive. Let's see how it goes. Very successful. Who needs a heater? Bloody hell it's hot in here now. <laughs> so cold outside. Yeah, bypass the heater for now, there's a problem up the front. Yes, that goes very, very well now. Very pleased.
Keep on holding pressure. The radiator held up for now. I'll get out of here while it goes through heat, so <coughs> in case it explodes. I'll start it again in about 15 minutes. The temperature gauge is totally useless. Disconnected. Oh, this old thing smells like a V-line train station. I did go for a cool off drive, but the brakes are still pretty hot. So I gave the engine a bit of hell, clear the injectors out. Uh, I'll change the filter after this now. It's um, yeah, a bit smelly, the old girl is. Hmm.